If your business involves the production or importation of food and drug related products, you cannot run such business in Nigeria without properly registering with the National Agency for Food and Drug Administration and Control, NAFDAQ. Due to the assumed stringent procedure of NAFDAQ registration, many run away from involvement in any food or drug business or look for ways to cut corners. Regardless, many companies have been able to successfully get NAFDAQ approval for their products. Many people find the process difficult because of a lack of adequate information. In this video, you will get the necessary information you need to begin and complete your registration with NAFDAQ. Before I go any further, may I just say, welcome to entrepreneurs.ng. NAFDAQ permit basically covers two categories, food and drugs. Therefore, if manufactured or imported goods fall within these two categories, registration with NAFDAQ is mandatory. Also, note that the food or drugs company must first register with the Corporate Affairs Commission CSE before registering their products with NAFDAQ. To ensure the safety of Nigerian citizens, every manufacturer, exporter, importer or trader of drug and food related products must comply with the registration requirements set down by NAFDAQ. Let us look at the evolution of NAFDAQ. The National Agency for Food and Drug Administration and Control is a federal agency under the Federal Ministry of Health. It is the body responsible for regulating the importation, manufacturing, exportation, distribution, sale and use of food, drugs, cosmetics, medical devices, chemicals and packaged water in Nigeria. In 1989, over 150 children died as a result of paracetamol syrup containing dietylene glycol. At the time, the issue of fake drugs was rampant in the country, such that neighboring countries like Sierra Leone and Ghana banned the sales of foods, drugs, and beverages made in Nigeria. The problem led to the establishment of NAFDAQ. The aim of NAFDAQ is to ensure that all imported or locally produced food and drugs are safe for consumption. In December 1992, NAFDAQ's first governing council was formed. The council was headed by Tanimu Salawa. In 1994, NAFDAQ was officially established as a parastatal of the Federal Ministry of Health. Let us look at NAFDAQ registration procedures. 1. The registration requirement for locally produced products is different from that of imported products. 2. Each NAFDAQ registration number is for a single product. If you have more than one product, you will have to get a separate registration number for the product. Now, how do you register with NAFDAQ? By the time you're done with these steps, you would have covered these six processes listed by NAFDAQ. Step 1. Get NAFDAQ registration form. Visit www.napens.org to register. NAPEN stands for NAFDAQ Automated Product Administration and Monitoring System. Next, sign in as a client. Set up your company profile. Once you're done with your profile, you save and proceed to log in. Now you can fill out the form for your product. To fill out the registration Form. Click on New Product Registration and provide all the information required for your product. If you prefer not to do this online, you can go to the NAFDAQ office closest to you to make your request known. NAFDAQ headquarters is located at plot 2302 Olushegun Obasanjo Way, Zone 7, Usei, Abuja, Nigeria. However, if you're not in Abuja, find the address of their zonal office in your state. Once you get there, purchase the NAFDAQ registration form and fill it out appropriately. As said earlier, each registration form can only be used for a single product. So if you have more than one product, you will need to purchase more than one form. Step two, submit your registration. The form will request product name, product description, manufacturer's name, who the product is for, the components of the product, request for documents and other important questions. Once you're done filling, submit it online. Also, provide NAFDAQ with relevant information and a description of your facility for proper inspection. This stage may be quite tedious, but it's always worth the while. Step three, submit samples of your products. After completing the online process, you will be notified to submit three samples of your product for inspection and analysis. As soon as you complete this stage, a certificate of recognition as a manufacturer will be issued to you. Step four, make necessary payment. The next step is to pay your fees. To avoid delays, make the required payment on time. The fee and tariff is to be determined by the type and the category of your product. Step 5 is your certificate collection. After your product is registered, you'll be given a NAFDAQ registration number and certificate of registration for the product. You may want to ask, how long does NAFDAQ registration take? 1. Registration of food products take not more than 90 days after acceptance of the application. 
Two, drug products registration takes not more than 120 days from acceptance of the application. Three, variation of product registration takes not more than 60 days. Okay, let's go over the registration processes with timelines. One, submission of application begins from zero days. Two, verification of documents takes 10 days. Three, facility inspection and sampling takes 10 days for food and 20 days for drugs. Four, Laboratory analysis takes up to 30 days for food and 40 days for drugs. Number five, final vetting takes 10 days. And six, approval meeting or issuance of NAVDAP registration number takes 20 days. The total number of days equals 90 days for food and 120 days for drugs. Let's look at the procedure for registering imported goods with NAVDAP. To register imported goods with NAVDAP, the foreign company needs to send samples of your product for analysis. But this is not possible without proper approval to bring in the samples. Hence, the foreign company must first apply for approval to bring the samples into Nigeria. To do this, NAVDAC issues special written authorization or import permits to enable importers to bring in the samples of their products. In addition, the importer must also obtain the documents required for the clearing and delivering of samples from the manufacturer and other relevant bodies in the country of origin. Moving on, let's look at NAVDAC registration requirements for food products. 1. The first requirement is Certificate of Incorporation obtained from the Corporate Affairs Commission CSE. 2. You need Certificate of Inspection or Recognition issued by NAVDAC. 3. The trademark approval for your brand name by the Federal Ministry of Commerce where applicable. 4. Comprehensive certificate of analysis of the batch of the product of registration from the manufacturer stating the name and signature of the analyst. And five, your application form forwarded to the director stating the name of the manufacturer, brand name, and product. Let's look at the NAVDAC registration requirements for drugs. It also requires certificate of incorporation issued by DAC. So you need to submit three samples of your product for quality analysis inspection. Three, assigned and endorsed certificate of pharmaceutical products. Four, original copy of power of attorney from the product manufacturer if imported. Five, the application letter for registration of the product. Six, letter of invitation from the manufacturer to inspect factory abroad with full names and site of the plant. 7. Completed NAVDAC application form. Moving on to registration requirements for imported goods. Take note that the registration requirement for imported goods, that is for food and drugs, include all the previously mentioned requirements. In addition to those, there are other conditions you must also meet if you want to register imported products with NAVDAC. 1. An applicant must submit a power of attorney or contract manufacturing agreement from the manufacturer authorizing the Nigerian representative to act in their capacity in Nigeria. The document must be signed by the director or president of the company. Also, the power of attorney or the contract manufacturing agreement must be notarized by the notary public in the country of the manufacturer. Two, a certificate of free sale must be issued by a relevant health or regulatory body in the manufacturer's country. The certificate must indicate the name of the manufacturer and the product. A comprehensive certificate of analysis must be presented on a letter-headed paper of the quality control laboratory where the sample was tested or evaluated. It should contain the following. The analysis of the product or goods, the batch number of the product, manufacturing and expiry dates, name, designation, and signature of the analyst. Or you must provide evidence that the manufacturer of the imported food or drug is licensed to sell such product in the country of origin and that the sale of the product does not constitute a contravention of the food laws of the country of origin. 5. Permit to import samples. 6. A letter of invitation to inspect the facility abroad. The NAVDAC registration process can be tough for businesses in Nigeria, which is why some businesses look for ways to cut costs. But if you want to run a sustainable business without fear, it is important that you do it the right way. The information in this video will guide you in applying for your NAVDAC number. Go ahead and make that application. Enjoy the process, get your NAVDAC registration number, and run your business without looking over your shoulders. If this information was useful to you, please like and share with your friends. Are you doing something extraordinary in your industry and you want the world to hear about it? Reach out to us today to tell your story. Let's write your business story in a way that resonates with your customers. Contact us today. Buy the 35 Women Business Ideas and Step-by-Step -step Guide on how to start them. 
This guide has 35 businesses you can choose from. Interested in running a business but you are not sure which is viable? Start here. Head now to our shop to get a copy for just 5,000 euros. You want further explanations on getting your NAFTEC number. You want to understand the laws guiding the running of a business in Nigeria. Then purchase the ultimate legal guide to doing business in Nigeria. The links displayed on your screen shows you all of our unique offerings. Head to entrepreneurs.ng to know more about them. Follow us on all of our social media platforms to keep track of all of our activities. So we'll see you next time. It's bye for now.